Hello students, welcome to Academia. Today, our discussion will be Museum Technique, Part 2. In the first discussion, the definition of museum, museum technique were discussed, as well as the technique, how the museums are prepared. In the basic museum techniques, we have already seen the reception and preparation of the specimen. In today's video, the latter processes like the fixation, color restoration, preservation, presentation, etc. are discussed. Now, the fixation of the specimen. Generally, uh, for every tissue, if we gone through the tissue processing, the fixation is the number one step. Why we done fixation? The objective of fixation is to preserve cells and tissue constituents in as close to lifelike state as possible. So that after uh, many days, if we uh, process the tissue and uh, get the section, we can see the similar morphological and histological structures in that particular tissue. Fixation arrests autolysis. What is autolysis? Autolysis is the destruction of the tissue by itself. They also prevent bacterial decomposition and stabilizes the cellular and tissue constituents. The fixatives used in a museum all over the world are based on formalin fixative techniques. Generally, different type of fixatives are used for different kind of tissues, but basically they are uh, based on the formalin fixative technique. So, what are the fixation techniques for different type of tissues? First of all, the specimens which contain bile or stained by bile must be fixed and stored apart from others. The specimens undergoing fixation must not touch other specimens. The flat flaps of tissue like stomach, intestine etc should be fixed to cork board and left in formalin so that they are not crumpled and irregularly fixed so these kind of things we should keep in our mind or these are uh, the standard ways to fix for the museum unopened cystic cavities should be injected with fixative if opened, they should be packed with cotton wool. And for the solid viscera, they are fixed by vascular injection. The lungs, the limbs are particularly suitable for fixation by vascular injection. So these are uh, some of the examples uh, that uh, what will be the fixation technique for different different type of uh, organs in of human body. This fixation method is described by Kaiser Ling in 1897. There are three solutions. First for fixing, second for restoring color and the third a mounting fluid. So keep this in mind that three solution having three kind of activities. First Kaiser Ling Number one, it is the fixing fluid. Kaiserling, number two, it is uh, uh, helping in uh, the restoration of the color. And the Kaiserling, three, which help in the process of mounting. So one by one, uh, just we see uh, the composition of the fluids.
in the kaiserling number 1 the fixation is for 24 hours to few weeks it depends on the size of the specimen it contains formalin potassium nitrate potassium acetate and water next one is the kaiserling number 2 solution here the specimens are placed in 80% ethyl alcohol solution for optimal period of 1 hour and it may be 4 hours depending on the size of the specimen if the specimen is left for too long in alcohol the color will fade and this effect is irreversible so how the color restoration occur the fixed specimen is now transferred to a jar containing industrial methylated spirit until the color is fully restored the alcohol penetrates the tissues rapidly if the specimen floats it should be lightly covered with surgical gauze and the vessel closed to prevent the evaporation color restoration is usually complete in 2 to 8 hours so uh, the timings are very important regarding the fixation regarding the color restoration process the next one is the kaiserling number 3 solution so it contains glycerin arsenious acid acetate and thymol there are different factors which affect the fixation first of all buffering then penetration then volume temperature concentration time interval and position of tissue the buffering is what fixation is best carried out close to neutral ph in the range of 6 to 8 the penetration depends upon the diffusibility of each individual fixative what do you mean by volume the minimal acceptable volume of fixation fluid is about 15 to 20 times the volume of the specimen so this uh, much fluid is given so that we can get the proper fixation the temperature also uh, be regulate increasing the temperature will increase the speed of the fixation hot formalin will fix the tissues faster now the concentration of the fixative should be adjusted down to the lowest level possible now moving to the preservation technique the specimen together with a duplicate label is wrapped in gauze or muslin and the label attached with a piece of linen thread the specimens are preserved in large rectangular tanks the fluid used may be kaiserling fixing fluid 1 for the period of 6 month so the timings uh, are very important after which it should be treated with 80% alcohol to restore the color then the mounting has so in the museum technique part 3 the mounting process special methods and presentation will be discussed hope that today's discussion will help you in understanding the fixation process of 
म्यूजियम टेक्निक इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेरी और क्वेश्चन यू कैन आस्क इन द कमेंट बॉक्स थैंक यू